We was at the bar last night, and, and I'm amazed that I went because my wife watches after my health a lot better than I do. I don't like going to the doctor. All they're going to give you is bad news. And and they, and they look so mournful when they're doing it, usually. Some of them smile because they found out what was wrong with you, what you didn't know and didn't want to know. And and I had I had been avoiding one of those cold, cold scopies. That's where they stick that thing where you don't want them to stick it to make it look sure your bowels don't have something in there what shouldn't ought to be there that could turn into something what you don't want. And I don't want to go to that. And anyway, because you got to take this medicine, smells like fermented puke, tastes like fermented puke, and you don't puke, but but you have to you have to have a close personal relationship with the, the lavatory and the toilet. And I, I always bring in some magazines and fishing. I always bring in fishing magazines, and I sit there and read them and read them and read them and read them until you're you're more cleaned out than an empty gas can. I mean, there ain't nothing left. And so I went in for this coscopy. Anyway, I went in there for that thing. And the doctor wasn't, I know him, but I just don't feel like anybody knows me well enough to go sticking something into my plumbing. And so they give me this drug, and I don't remember nothing except coming out and being grateful to be out. But I was powerful hungry. I hadn't eaten in quite a while. And my wife said, you know, you're hungry? And, and I didn't talk to the doctor or nothing. This was after we'd gotten out. And they won't let you drive yourself after that, and I understand why. So we went to my favorite barbecue place, what has spicy barbecue. And I find out when you're having a, col a coloscopy, um, your intestines fall asleep and they don't want no food for a while. Well, I went ahead and ate the spiciest barbecue they had because it tastes real good. Don't do that. I just rented it for five minutes. It was gone. It didn't come out the other end. It came out the mouth and I was a spewing and coughing. They felt so far, far sorry for me at that barbecue place. They, they said, come back and we'll feed you again when you ain't barfing. So here's the rule. If you're going to have one of them colon things or scopies, don't eat no spicy food for a while.